Uh, look who's here now. <laughs> a very important guest right at the top of the show on a very important day. Eddie Gabor is back. Eddie, look, before we get to the market, I want to ask you about inflation. Do you think that inflation really is moderating? It is moderating, but the thing is, it's moderating from an extremely high pace. So I think what we have to focus on, and I know DC is going to spike the ball today and talk about how this is a big win, but Main Street doesn't think 8.5 or 8.1 or even if it's 7.1 is a win. We are in a high inflationary environment. It's very sticky, and it's going to stay that way for a while. So regardless of what the Fed does, the damage is done, and growth is decelerating right now. And we now are going to be seeing CPI slowly come down. So traditionally speaking, when that happens, we are heading potentially into a deflationary environment. That is not an environment you want to be in. So the momentum is already going in the wrong way Whoa. in regards to the economy. Uh, and yeah, yeah, inflation always has to peak at some point in time. Uh, but there's a lot of people right now that have never been in an environment like this, and it's but, not going to correct itself over a month or two. You know not you're even in, close. You know you're in deep water, Eddie. You've been saying to people, stay out of this market. You've been saying it for a long time. And now we've got a, a nice rally on lower inflation. Are you still predicting a big drop in the relatively near future? I am, Stuart. And look, we're not in hot water because of when we started de-risking. You know, I was on your show December the 8th of yep. last year when yep. we started de-risking. The markets are still down 20% from those peaks. So, you know, I need to see conviction that growth is not slowing and that Main Street is not hurting because that momentum, again, we're in the early innings of this recession that we're going to go in. I expect GDP to continue to get worse over the next two quarters. I think we're going to find out whether we're right or wrong in the next three months. If I'm wrong, I'll come on your show. I will pivot. I'm not going to stay bearish if the data continues turns and becomes bullish, okay. but I'm also not going to just follow a narrative to fit where I want to be from an asset allocation perspective. So I think this economy is heading in the wrong direction and it's going to excel accelerate on the downside over the next two quarters. Okay. Uh, and so I can't get bullish in that environment. Okay. We hear you. And uh, we're dying to see what you're going to say next week and the week after and the month after that. Eddie Gabor, come back soon. Wait. Yes, sir. Thanks very much indeed. Thank you, Stuart.